Dear first semester VTU mechanical engineering stream students, I welcome you all into my channel again. Hope you are all doing well. So in this video, I will be discussing the passing package uh, for you students. This is not only the passing package, but it is the scoring uh, package over here. Okay, you can easily score more than 80 marks. If you are going through the numericals, then definitely you can get out of out by this much portion. So subject code is BCHEM102. This is for the mechanical stream. So let me discuss here model wise. Uh, super important questions want to score more than 95 marks then then definitely you have to go through the numericals from module first second and third so rest of the questions i have taken over here so module 5 is the uh, scoring module in which you can easily get uh, 20 marks by this much portion first of all we have the super important question what are alloys explain composition properties and applications of uh, alnico what are what are uh, perovskites mention any four properties and applications of uh, perovskites what are nanomaterials explain any three size dependent and properties of nanomaterials and fourth one we have explained the synthesis of nanomaterial by sol gel method this is super important one explain composition properties and applications of stainless steel explain the composition along with properties of brass and write a note on carbon nanotubes mention any four properties and applications of carbon nanotubes and seventh one we have explained the synthesis of nanomaterial by co-precipitation method and also explain the properties and application of graphene so this is all about your module fifth if you are covering this this much portion you can easily get 20 marks coming to the module 4 which is again a scoring module in which you have to cover these super important ones like explain the principle and instrumentation of optical sensor for the estimation of copper describe the estimation of total hardness of water by using edta method and define phase rule and explain the following terms with an example like phase components and degree of freedom Fourth one, we have explained the estimation of FAS potentiometrically uh, using, uh, using calomelan platinum electrode as potentiometric sensors. Explain the principle in instrumentation and working of potentiometric sensor. Sixth one, we have discussed the lead silver two component system along with phase diagram. This is again the most important question. Explain the principle in instrumentation and working of glass electrode. Explain the determination of pH of beverages using glass electrode. Last question from the module fourth, we have explained the principle in instrumentation and working of calorimetry. Coming to module sorry this is here model one it is not model three it is just a typing mistake uh, you can just correct it it is the, uh, these questions are from model first so my scoring module over here in which you have to go through define uh, calorific value explain principal construction and working of uh, bum calorimeter to determine uh, gcv and ncv of a solid fuel uh, describe the construction and working of methanol oxygen fuel cell third one we have explained the construction and working of photovoltaic cells and mention any two applications what are green fuels explain the synthesis of biodiesel by uh, transistorification write any four applications describe the construction and working of lithium-ion battery and mention any two applications define a fuel determine calorific value of fuels with a bum calorimeter last two questions we are having explain the production of hydrogen by electrolysis method and mention its advantages okay last one we have here numerical uh, 0 0.945 gram of a fuel on complete combustion in excess of oxygen increase the temperature of water in a calorimeter from 13.25 degree centigrade to 19.2 degree centigrade the mass of water in calorimeter was uh, 1458 grams calculate gcv if water equivalent of calorimeter is 144 gram you can just go through similar varieties of numericals if you want to score more than 95 marks then coming to the model second we have here define metallic corrosion describe the electrochemical theory of corrosion taking iron as an example most important one and explain differential metal corrosion and water line corrosion differential aeration corrosion describe galvanizing and mention its applications fourth one we have what is metal finishing mention any five of its technological importance and mention any four properties and applications of q -led. what is electroplating explain electroplating of chromium as hard and decorative coatings seventh one we have defined electroless plating explain electroless plating of nickel what is sacrificial anodic protection explain okay this is all about your model second now coming to model third explain the synthesis properties and applications of kevlar what are lubricants explain any four properties and applications of lubricants 
explain the synthesis properties and applications of PMMA what are fibers explain any four properties and applications of polystyrene explain a metal matrix composite with an example explain any four properties and applications of metal matrix composites what are polymers explain the different methods of polymerization seventh one we have explained the synthesis of CPVC and mentioned its application that is a chlorinated polyvinyl chloride what are composites explain the properties and application of carbon based reinforced composites uh, graphene and uh, carbon nanotube all about your scoring package of the chemistry subject for the mechanical engineering stream okay so make sure you will refer these questions and these questions should be at your utmost priority so all the best for your examinations dear make sure you will share this video to all your friends and batchmates thank you